Hello, science fans. Mr. Walsh here. And Floppy, please say hello to everybody. Hello to everybody. Just say hello the normal way, please. Hello the normal way, please. Just say hi. Hi. Thank you. Uh, since it is poetry month, we figured we'd share some science poems with you. I think Floppy has one for you. Yes. Can you please uh, say your poem? Yes. Well, now what? We're waiting to hear your poem. Oh, you want me to say it? Yes! I just asked you to. No, you didn't. What are you talking about? You said, can you tell us the poem? Not, will you tell us the poem? Will you please tell us the poem? Yes. Thank you. <clears throat> Science is fun. Science is cool. Take it from me. I ain't no fool. Thank you. Thank you. All right. Mr. Walsh is going to read you a poem. A science poem. A good science poem. It is about something crazy that was happening in the science room a few years ago. There was a problem. Something, somebody or something was ruining everything in my room. Here it is. It's a mystery. Let's see if you can solve the mystery. See if you can figure out who was causing the problem in the science room. Are you ready? It's called The Mystery Mess Maker by Mr. Walsh. Mysterious little creatures are messing up my room. I find things have been nibbled. Can you guess by whom? Mischievous little creatures have been doing naughty stuff. They ate some of my Skittles, and as if that weren't enough, they stained some paper yellow. With what, I dare not think. Everywhere that they have been, there is an icky stink. It's messy enough already here without their adding to it. Are little elves pulling pranks, laughing as they do it? Something moved there in the corner. Let's see who it could be. I set one of my famous traps. There is no escaping me. Aha! I finally caught him. Now I'll get to see just who's been playing all these little nasty tricks on me. Gremlin? Pixie? Brownie? Ghost? Whatever could it be. I take a look and see a furry face look back at me. Two inches long, soft brown fur, round ears, and small black eyes. I caught the rascal. The mystery is solved. I should have realized. Whiskers, long tail, squeaky voice, not welcome in the house. Scientists call him mus musculus, but you'd call him a mouse. Did you guess it? I bet you did. Okay, guys. Bye for now.